guys, it's the Polished Panther here, and today I will be doing a review on Red Carpet Manicure's Must Haves Kit. The starter kit comes with Prep, Structure, Brilliance, Revitalize, Purify, and Erase. I also bought this gel matte top coat by Sensationale to put to the test. I will be putting links to all the products shown in this video in the description below. First, I'm taking prep and applying it to my nails and letting it evaporate into thin air. This should take the moisture and oils out of your nail, which will let the base coat attach to your nails better and let your mani last longer. Next, I'm going in with structure, which is simply a base coat. It will give the colors a better surface to connect to while smoothing out your nail of any bumps. After your base coat has cured, we can move on to the color. In the starter kit, they did not provide a color gel, which is a little disappointing, but that's okay because I have this color gel, Baby Doll Pink, by Sensation Nail. Now, as you can see, this color is very sheer, so it will need more than just a few coats to be opaque. This is me applying my fifth coat of color, and it's still a little bit see-through, but it's fine with me because I'll be putting some designs on it, so it really won't be that noticeable. I tried to record how I drew the unicorn for this design, but the camera angle was awkward, and I didn't like the way it turned out. So I decided that I would start the unicorn over without recording. The hair was painted using purple acrylic paint. I just took a toothpick and tried making it as neat as possible. I just started with a darker purple and filled in where the hair would be, then took a lighter purple for the highlights. Then I went back in with the dark purple for extra dimension. Now that the hair is complete, we're going to move on to the next design. So I'm just taking the sponge and cutting the tip off of it. I'll be using this to sponge on a little bit of acrylic paint in areas to kind of give it another pastel effect. And I really like the way it turned out and you can see that in just a second. First I'm starting with pink. Then I'm going in with white, and now a light purple. Now I'm moving on to the empty parts of my design and dabbing on some more color there. Now I'm taking Brilliance, the top coat, and I'm going to put a nice glossy top coat on top of all of these nails. After I let that cure and wiped away the stickiness, I decided to file down any bumps on the nail and just create a smooth surface using a dull nail file. I'm doing this because I'm applying another top coat after this, and so why not just smooth out the surface and make it more even? Here's the matte top coat by Sensation Nail, and I'm just applying one coat to each of my nails 
And after that cured, I wiped the stickiness and I was left with a matte finish. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time.